the first time that he physically hit you? Yes. Please tell the jury about it. <laughs> it was so, it's seemingly so stupid, so in, like insignificant. I will never forget it. It changed, it changed my life. I, I was sitting on the couch and we were talking, we were having a, like a normal conversation, you know, just, there was no fighting, no argument, nothing. And um, he was drinking and um, I didn't realize at the time, but I think he was using cocaine because it was like there was a jar, a jar of cocaine out on the table. I, re I realize that sounds weird, but it was like a, an actual vintage jar of it. But I didn't see him use it at the time, so I, I didn't really factor that in. I just, you know, he's drinking and we're talking and it's there's music playing and he's smoking cigarettes and we're sitting next to each other on the couch. And I ask him about the tattoo he has on his arm. And to me, it just looked like um, black marks. It, like, I didn't know, I didn't know what it said. It just looked like muddled, faded tattoo that was hard to read. And I said, what, is it, what does it say? And he um, said, it says, why no? It says, why no? And I, um, I didn't see that. I thought he was joking uh, because it didn't look like it said that at all. And I laughed. It was that simple. Um, I, I just laughed because I thought he was joking. And slapped me across the face. And I laughed. I laugh because I, I didn't know what else to do. I thought, this must be a joke. This must be a joke. Because I'm, I didn't know what was going on. I just stared at him, kind of laughing still, thinking that he was going to start laughing too to tell me it was a joke. But he didn't. He said, you think it's so funny? You think it's funny, bitch. You think you're a funny bitch. And he slapped me again. Like, I wasn't clear. It wasn't a joke anymore. And I stopped laughing, but I didn't know what else to do. You know, you... I, 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 I didn't know what to do. You, you would think you, you would have a response, but I, as a woman, had never been hit like that. I'm an adult and I'm sitting next to the man I love and he slapped, he slapped me for no reason it seemed like and I missed the point. It was that stupid. Second slap, I know he's not kidding but I don't know what else to say or do so I just stared at him. I didn't say anything, I didn't react, I didn't move or freak out or defend myself or, or say what are you doing, you're crazy. I just stared at him because I didn't know what else to do and he slaps me one more time hard. I lose my balance. Um, at this point, we're sitting next to each other at the, on the edge of the couch, or I was on the edge of the couch. And I'm all of a sudden realizing that the worst thing has just happened to me that could possibly happen to you. I realized that I, I wish so much he had said he was joking because it didn't hurt didn't physically hurt me. I was just sitting there on this, on, on this carpet, looking at the dirty carpet, wondering how I wound up on this carpet and why I was never, why I never noticed that the carpet was so filthy before. And I just didn't know what else to do. I didn't know what to say. I didn't know how to react. I just sat there thinking, how much time do I have to I figure out what I need to do? Because God, did he just hit me? No, I didn't want to leave him. I didn't want this to be the reality. I didn't want to have the man I was in love with. I know you don't come back from that. You know, I'm not dumb. I, I know you can't hit a woman. I, you can't hit a man. You can't hit anyone. You can't just hit somebody because they... I knew there was no... I knew it was wrong, and I knew that I had to leave him. And that's what broke my heart because I didn't want to leave him. I thought if I got up out of that room, I'd leave the best thing that ever happened to me. 
And I wish I could sit here and say I stood up and I walked out of that house and I drew a line and I stood up for myself. <laughs> but I was just looking at the dirty carpet trying to will myself to get up, to walk out of the door because I knew I needed to. And I really slowly, I stood up and I remember looking at him in the eye and just looking at him, frankly, because I didn't know what else to do. And before I know it, he starts crying. And, you know, like, I, I had never seen an adult man cry. Um, I didn't even really see my dad cry at my grandma's funeral. You know, it's just, it's weird. 